all ncrt point is fully covered without irrelevant things the living world chapter 1 part 1 growth reproduction ability to sense environment and mount to a suitable response come to our mind immediately are unique features of living organisms one can add a few more features like metabolism, ability to self-replicate, self-organize, interact and emergence to this list. All living organisms grow, increase in mass and increase in number of individuals are two in characteristics of growth important. A multicellular organism grows by cell division in plants and this growth by cell division occurs continuously throughout their lifespan. In animals this growth is seen only up to a certain age. However, cell division occurs in certain tissue to replace lost cells. Unicellular organisms grow by cell division. One can easily observe this in vitro cultures by simply counting the number of cells under microscope. One must remember that increase in body mass is considered as growth. Non-living objects also grow if we take increase in body mass as criterion for growth. Mountains, boulders and sand mounds do grow, however this kind of growth exhibited by non-living objects is by accumulation of material on the surface. In living organisms growth is from inside, growth therefore cannot be taken as a defining property of living organism. A dead organism does not grow.